In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God, our loving Father, you are the good Father who always listens to the cries of your suffering children. As you listened to the cries of your children Israelites under Pharaoh, listen to the cries of your children from Myanmar as they cry under a new and even more cruel Pharaoh. Lord, turn your merciful eyes to the miseries of your children in Myanmar. The peace-loving people of Myanmar elected their leaders, whom the military unjustly and ruthlessly put in prison. Thousands of young people are put in prison too, for the simple reason that they requested peace and justice they desire so much for all the people. Some children were arrested, others were shot dead, and still others mercilessly killed while they were studying in their school when the military dropped a bomb. These children were just 10 or 11 years old. So many villages were totally burnt out. The homes where they have their cherished memories, where they grew up, where they learned how to love others and how to live in harmony with all, went down to ashes within a few hours. Hundreds of thousands of your children have become homeless without food and medicine, and yet they have to keep running whenever they hear the military airplane or the soldiers approaching them. When the international community forgets our suffering nation, we have a strong temptation to think that you too are forgetting us. O oh Lord, come to our aid and do not delay. For from the morning watch until night, all that we see and here are the cries and sufferings of your innocent children. May the prayers of all of us who are taking part in this event reach you and then bring us your blessings so that we may enjoy peace and justice again in our poor and suffering nation. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Mary, help of Christians, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.